At the moment, um, we've got a poetry platform happening in York Explore, and then following that, um, we have a, a free poetry writing workshop uh, with a wonderful poet from Newcastle called Anna Woodford. And we also have an exhibition which is put together with poems which Anna Woodford wrote um, last year and which were displayed on some of the buses in York, so people might have seen those. I'm an English graduate, as many people who work in libraries are, um, and I really thought I didn't like modern poetry. I thought I only liked poetry where the poets were safely dead um, and, uh, and, and it was kind of classic and tried and tested. Um, and then about two years ago, I got talking to some customers here in the library and they were very keen that we should start some sort of poetry evening um, here, at, here at York Explore. So I said, OK, why not? Um, and as a result of that, we started to run um, Finding the Words poetry evenings um, on uh, just about the last Thursday of the month, um, in uh, sort of every, every month through the year. And as a result of that, I, I had to go along because I'd organised this, and I started to listen to um, people who are writing now and I was amazed at the variety and the depth and the skill and the you know the the wealth of talent really which is just available and I just wish more people would just take an hour out of their month and come and try it because the feedback that I've had from people who have done that is kind of the same as mine. Gosh, I didn't know that I liked poetry, but actually, you know, I'm really glad I came. Poetry is a way in which people express themselves and their deepest thoughts. It's very, very good that we have a National Poetry Day celebrating that. Poetry is booming across the country, and this kind of is a pinnacle of it. It says to everybody, poetry is for you. Come and get it. Write it, listen to it, read it. I got involved because poetry in my teens was a way of expressing things I couldn't express in any other way. I've still got the first poem that I ever had published, which was when I was 18, and it's absolute rubbish and I'm embarrassed by it, but I get it out every now and again to wave it at myself and say, Ooh! So it's just a way for me of expressing something I couldn't express in any other way, and I've been doing it all my life, but over the last 10 years, say, I've been devoting more time to it as I've retired. Anybody can write poetry because everybody has got something to say and often poetry is a good way of saying it.